Sorry I'm late with the update. I'm just here to share my opinion, so you're welcome to stay around. I know you love me. Anyways, we're gonna talk about a lot of things. New seasons, upcoming seasons, the Valentine's pin. This it, it felt like SMC is just going repetitive things now. And global tends to be ignored. So we're gonna go through one by one and I just wanna voice out that they shouldn't always make people waiting. So let's go. Alright, before we talk about the pension, I wanna talk about this first. First of all, they talk about hacking. And you know what happens, like the hentai code showing on the chat, general chat and stuff like that. What? I think personally, yes, they're, they're encouraging us to like report them, but they should always be on 24 7 And if they cannot do it at the 24 7 they should always like maybe call out with one player. It doesn't necessarily have to be me, but maybe talk to players. Ask these players to go undercover that all these players, that the people that they can trust, will bound to like help them report immediately so that they can take immediate action. Like all those hentai code or all those hacking happen, actually you should do emergency maintenance immediately. Because these are like a very shameful thing for a game to happen. Children are playing this game and immediate action like this should always... I know you're taking zero tolerance, but you gotta act fast SMC. I don't want to see that kind of thing happens again. I, I know you cannot stop hackers from doing what they like to do. That's why the de developers have to act fast. So maybe considering having a undercover players to always report them, always contact them. All right, we're talking about Crimson Valley and they talk about it's coming. I promise we can hear the demand of the map. Now Crimson Valley has been around on the Steam version on China for about four to five months now. What What is it taking so long to come to the global? I understand that the Steam and the China server are sharing similar models like they are actually different kind of games different kind of graphics and to just copy and paste it to the global server would t totally like confuse and messed up the game but one thing i want to on a regular update is okay okay please believe that blah 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 blah, blah. okay so they said they need another three months here's the thing you shouldn't always keep your customers waiting I know we're just virtual customers, but when you're dealing with actual real customers, you don't tend to always keep them wait. I know people will eventually come back, but Crimson Valley, people have been waiting for very long, and you shouldn't always keep them waiting, okay? So the Sakagan crossover, I don't want to talk about this so much. We have so many banners, so if you're a player that uh, is interested in Sakugan, then you might want to like save up your tickets and aim for Sakugan. So I don't think there's a lot of things over here. I think Sakugan is gonna be coming around October. I think that's when the movies is going to be released, but don't know when the collab will be coming. They, they do mention that in the YouTube channel of Anima Studio that they are having collab with SMC. So looking forward to that. Now regarding Promare, a lot of people asking about Promare. Now they never said that they will cancel Promare on the channel server, but I don't think it's gonna be coming global. I really hope Promare comes to global because it's really popular among the weeps. So hopefully they do Promare on the global server. So Granblum event, Steam version never had a rerun for Granblum uh, event and we really wanted that Neutron Star skin. So can you can you just make a rerun for the Steam version? Why put it there when we can't get it? Unless we're waiting until the channel server is getting a rerun, then that wouldn't be fair. But yeah, considering so many collab is happening, then I don't mind waiting for a while. Okay, so lastly, season 8 is coming to an end, blah 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 blah, meow appearance. So you guys, the mobile is getting the meow meow coin in the lobby, and that, that, that's it. That, that's it. Why? <sighs> okay, never mind. Okay, same time. Now, they're doing things repetitively. We need some sort of a new mode that is a big game changing, like maybe a faction war or clan war. Try to implement that um, because Battle Royale and TDM has always been the main dish of the game. But we need something that needs to be like a big dish as well. Like, you know, not the, all those mini games where we just play for fun. We need something big as well. Maybe Faction War, 30 versus 30, pick, pick, a, pick a side. I don't know. Maybe that's just my dream. But I will make a separate video on uh, talking about what game mode SMC should really consider in the future. Okay, Michael Rebalance is understood because maybe they messed up during his release, they increased the primary damage against mecha and decreased the secondary damage against mecha because you can actually one shot people, maybe they don't intend to do that. So I can understand why they modify Michael. Increase the fuel cost for his dash, second dash is not infected. Now let's talk about Alborada over here. I main Alborada personally and this thing with core to wreck. And this thing is supposed to be a support, not a not an offense, not a DPS. 
but they decided to buy this, a mecha that doesn't need it. Decrease the reload reloading time, but you can also use Cyrus skill to not tell a difference. Wait, this is a buff, reloading time for- okay, 2.2, this is actually a buff, and Alvarado is getting massive buff. She's already so strong. She's supposed to be support. She's not supposed to be DPS. I don't know why they do that. Boltus is already so strong. I know they decrease her, her secondary attack, but they increase the damage for primary attack. So what's the difference then? You nerf the secondary attack, you buff the primary attack. What's the difference? Dude is still overpowered, man. Neutron Star doesn't need it. Increase damage for second weapon, the Bayonet. Increase the damage. Decrease shield. Now, it doesn't necessarily you play Neutron Star. I'm a Neutron Star main as well, and you don't really use a lot of uh, Bayonet. Sometimes you use the dodge. Utilize your your gun to in order to close range, so... Don't need it. Andromeda needs a buff. They decrease it. Why? Why you decrease Andromeda? He, she needs a buff. Caramel. Decrease damage reduction for current... Okay. Decrease... Uh, the great story. Okay, 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 fine. Now, new event, fairy training, blah, 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 Complete all those events. Sign in August, okay, sign in, share, okay, okay. New pilot, welcome back system, okay. Anyone new, come back, come back. Probably not something very good, as usual. Adjustment and optimization, blah, 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 blah. Recruitment system where people can expect it, okay. That's it, everything done. Okay, improved performance for the ass place. Okay, nothing much, nothing much. Improved visual image for Mila Hair, okay, nothing much. <sighs> It's, it's like we always undergo this phase where there's nerf and buff again, nerf and buff again. There, there's never a constant decision. They're always thinking what to do. Like they need to come out with one and then just sit there. But I understand that sometimes this thing happen because new upcoming pilots is coming and they don't want to feel like it's overpowered. Ugh, whatever. Okay, um, more gacha to do. Now, this is something repetitive. Not, not like I'm not gonna go against it. You have to add something creative. I don't know what's coming. They said new mode? Okay, maybe. Chinese Valentine Day's Lucky Spin. So, Ning is getting another skin. How about Vita, man? Try to utilize it. Why you release them and release continuous new skin for the same character? I know they're like prioritizing their revenue, like they want to generate more money, so they always go for the more popular character. But Vita, come on, man. How about some other mecha skin as well? No, so we also have these. I probably will have to probably grind for this mecha select ticket. No, if you rope, I don't know about this. I hope it's free. I hope it's free. The new Raven skin, I hope it's free. Otherwise, I don't know. It's gonna be September, okay? Connect the Grail. So we got a lot of things going on. Chinese Valentine's. We see Fairyland. So Fairyland Fairy Theme is the next thing for season four or season nine. And that's probably my guess. So. Yeah, that, that's it. Nothing to talk about. We are going to repetitive, so they need to like add it, adding a new mode. And I know they promised PvE is coming, but again, like I said, don't keep people waiting for too long. And hackers again, like I said, you know, have under undercover players. If you're not gonna 24 hour seven monitors the game, then have a player to always like you know contact you. Thank you all so much for watching. Um, I need to just say that, you know, sometimes I protect the ace, sometimes I go against them. There's, there are things that I can acknowledge and there are things that I can understand. There are things that I need to point out. Of course, just like them, I'm not perfect as well. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and if you wanna, I don't know, I don't think there's anything to see this week. So maybe just normal streaming. Thank you all so much for watching.